I bought an NBA game ball for $200, and I'm going to do an unbiased review to let you know if you should buy it. Here's a one-star review of it. He says the ball feels like trash. It's very plasticky and cheap. It's wearing down very easily. Not very soft. Save your money is what he says. Here's a five-star review. The guy's telling you to buy it. He says it feels good. It doesn't get slippery when it's wet. Great shot coming off your hand. Okay. I just thought this one was funny. If a bowling ball and a basketball had a baby. All right, let's go and review it now for real. Here's the official NBA game ball. For you guys saying you have to wear it in. I've been using it for about three months. This is what it looks like after three months of use. So take that as you may. Here's the ball I'm going to compare it with. The Wilson Evolution. I've had this ball for eight years and I use it almost every day. Here's what it looks like. At the end of the video, I'll personally let you know if I think you should buy this ball. All right, here's a grip test. Let's see how easy I can palm it. On the seams, okay. Off the seams, okay. Off the dribble. Not bad. Just so you guys know, the first month you have this ball, it has zero grip. I couldn't even palm it. So it needs to be worn in before you get any grip whatsoever. Grip palming test with evolution. On the seams. Yeah, it's all right. Off the seams. Okay, okay. Off the dribble. Winner of the grip test. It was closer than I thought it was gonna be, but I'm choosing the Wilson Evolution. I think the bigger seams make it easier to palm. It's more reliable. If you're going up for a dunk, you're palming it. I know it's not gonna slip off if I'm, uh, if I'm uh, grabbing these seams right here. I hear people say the NBA ball is great with sweat. We're about to find out. Here's the sweat test. Oh, the button's over here. Let's take some shots. NBA ball, it's soaked now. Let's see, I get sweaty hands myself. Not too bad, it didn't slip. Got some more water on my hands. Here we go, we got the Wilson. We're gonna try another shot. Ooh, that completely slipped. All right, here's what I noticed. This one already absorbed all the water off the ball. This one's still a little bit wet, but when shooting, this ball has deeper, wider seams. This one barely has any. I could shoot this better with the sweaty hands, but it's gonna be harder to dribble and grip other than shooting. But shooting sweaty hands, I'm taking this one. Let's get some shots up when we're not sweaty. comes off so smooth. All right, the winner of best ball to shoot with. So this one felt the best. It comes off the fingertips real smooth, feels good. This one still feels good. I think this one wins though. Out of the hundreds of shots I've shot with both of them, I make a higher percentage. I don't know why, this one feels better to shoot but I just shoot better with this one. The verdict's in. Do I think you should buy this basketball? No, it's $200. The NBA is the only league that uses it. So you're just practicing with a different basketball that you'll never shoot with in the game. I like this ball better and you can get this one for $60. Hey, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm gonna review more basketball products. So let me know what I should review.